My song Living in the Borough is like a snapshot of a weekend in my life when I was about 14 or 15 years old. Me and my buddies going out on a Friday night and getting into trouble, getting drunk, smoking cigarettes, and doing those crazy things that kids used to do back in the uh, uh, was it late 70s, early 80s, however old I am. <laughs> I had a review recently where the guy was saying, you know, Joe, in the bridge of his song, he sings about his brother who got killed and his sister who got beat up and all this stuff, and he sings with such a polite voice. You almost want him to scream. You don't have to scream to get your point across. It's not an anger issue. It's more of a depressed feeling that I had when I was writing this song. But where I grew up was kind of in the shadow of the big city. I call it living in the borough because in my hometown there were these little pockets, these little boroughs, the Berg, there was El Moro, which is where we were. There was Bayway, which is where I grew up originally. And then you get over like the water, go across the Hudson and you get people in New York. You have the Queens, not the Queens, you have Queens. <laughs> Living in the boroughs for anybody who lived the scrapping life when they were younger and uh, maybe lived to tell about it. And, uh, I don't know, maybe looks back and figures out, you know, how far they've come since then, how they worked on themselves to better their lives. And after all, we're all just average Joes living in the borough.